A big competition in southern Illinois means big bucks in Lawrence County. And as News 10's Eric Stimmon tells us in this Economy Watch 10, it's a competition celebrating 25 years in the making. Lawrenceville or Red Hill? Red Hill or Lawrenceville? Mix in six more teams and you've got the 2013 Basketball Capital Classic. Well, this is our 25th year and uh, it's gotten nothing but bigger and brighter and better every year. If a Lawrence County school makes it to the top, it's bragging rights for a year. But for small businesses in Lawrence County, it's a win-win situation. So it brings a lot of money into the, uh, into the Lawrence County area. A lot, of, a lot of fans come and follow their, their teams. Sid's Place is a small shop not too far off the main drag in Lawrenceville. Owner Daryl Womack says he's known for his Taco Wednesday and Fridays, but in years past, the classic means a standing only wait in line atmosphere. Yeah, it's a, it's a good weekend for us. Most time we sell between anywhere between 600 and 1,000 tacos a night. And it's not just SIDS cashing in. Lots of businesses on the Lawrenceville Square will see bigger weekend crowds. Lawrenceville basketball dad and former player Brian Cochran says the environment is electric. Crowds are very nice, um, a lot bigger than we have during the regular season because we do get a lot of out, of out of town people following their teams. You know, it's good for the local economy, it's good for our local restaurants, and we love to see people from out of town come and spend their money in Lawrenceville. A few games of hoops helping Lawrence County's economy. In Indian and Saluki country, I'm Eric Stidman, News 10. Games at 2013 Basketball Capital Classic start tomorrow at 11 Central.